In the low country of South Carolina, on the island of Port Royal, is a charming little town called Buford. The town is in a great location and is known for its enormous harbor, seafood, exquisite southern architecture, and a variety of outdoor water activities. Buford has a rich and interesting history. The region was the focus of numerous European explorations and colonial attempts that failed. While passing through Buford, one can observe and learn the rich history and culture of the South. Nevertheless, history is alive today through the food which is still served in Buford. Get ready to try a taste of the South as we explore the best that the city has to offer. Number 12. Plums The atmosphere at Plums is very laid back, and the menu features traditional fried shrimp or oyster po' boys, burgers, and other mainstays. The restaurant also has an outdoor patio that overlooks the Buford River. Some of my go-to items on the menu include the famous Low Country Gumbo, Shrimp and Grits, and the delicious Crab Cakes. Number 11. Fish Camp on 11th Street. This restaurant overlooks the shrimp boats on the Buford River. This restaurant is known for its traditional low country and seafood items, which includes the chill bar oysters and shrimp, seafood towers, lobster bisque, low country bowls, blackened and fried seafood, and entrees like risotto with lobster tail. Number 10, Madison's. This restaurant is located in the picturesque Beaufort suburb of Port Royal. It is a family-owned restaurant with a relaxed atmosphere. Items such as burgers, pasta, and grits are just a handful of the mouth-watering options available here at Madison's. The amount of delicious seafood is a bonus, as is the raw oyster bar. They collaborate with a network of small farms and fisheries around the eastern seaboard to provide fresh, farm-to-table foods and are all staples of South Carolina grown products. Number 9. Saltus River Grill Locals and tourists alike go to Saltus River Grill for great dining because of its waterfront location and view of the Beaufort River. Fresh catch and seafood delicacies are the main attractions along with innovative sushi from the raw bar. There is also a busy cocktail bar, a well-liked patio with a fire pit, and a stylish but relaxed ambiance. Number 8. Red Rooster Cafe Traditional American comfort food with a flavorful southern twist is served at the Red Rooster Cafe. The metal rooster statue in front makes it difficult to miss, and depending upon the time of year, you might even be dressed for the season. Some of my notable go-to items include the chicken and waffles, crab benedict, or grandma's biscuits and gravy. Number 7. Wren Bistro and Bar At Wren, you can be confident that your entire eating experience will be enjoyable. Each dish is prepared with locally sourced fresh ingredients. We recommend the Mama's Freakin' Meatloaf, and we also really like the pecan chicken and the crispy flounder. At their inviting bar setup, they provide one-of-a-kind microbrews, carefully chosen wines, as well as specially crafted cocktails. Number 6. The Shrimp Shack One of Beaufort's most casual seafood eateries is the Shrimp Shack, located on St. Helena Island just over the Wood Memorial Bridge. It's a small restaurant with some picnic tables outside and a rustic, cozy atmosphere where you can order all your shrimp favorites. Here, the shrimp burger has earned its place in low country lore. Everything is prepared to order at this mom and pop restaurant, which only accepts cash. If you're ever in the Buford area, then the shrimp shack should definitely be on your to-do list. Number five, hearth wood fire pizza. Rustic styled hearth wood fire pizza is located on popular Bay Street and is known for its distinctive and traditional pizzas. Two of my personal favorite pies include the margarita and the shroomage. Along with the excellent appetizers like the meat and cheese board, there's also interesting salads, sandwiches such as the Italian Hero, and pasta dishes like the wood-fired lasagna. To top it off, there's also superb wine and beer selections to go along with the great food. Number 4. Ladies Island Dockside Ladies is a seafood lover's paradise. Being close to some of South Carolina's top fishing locations, they prepare fresh catches all day long. Plus, the outdoor terrace offers lovely views of the surroundings and is the perfect place to enjoy a nice beer in the warm South Carolina sun. A wide variety of crab, oyster, and lobster dishes are offered on the large menu. I recommend trying the captain's platter or the dockside diner to get a taste of all these seafood options. However, my number one recommendation is to go around sunset since the views of the Woods Bridge, the city, and Factory Creek with a painted sky behind them are absolutely gorgeous. Number three, Breakwater Restaurant and Bar. The southern style cuisine served at Breakwater are sure to please any palate. Each plate that is presented has a classy arrangement and the ambiance is very sophisticated. 
One of my personal favorites is the wild salmon, which you can get seared with an apple cider sauce or in an olive oil that has been infused with orange. Also, thanks to the ever-changing menu, there is always a fresh culinary masterpiece to explore. To top it all off, the bar's atmosphere and drink selection is outstanding, which will lead you wanting to come back for more. Number two, Griffin Market. To provide South Carolina residents with an authentic taste of Italy, Griffin Market imports all the sophisticated flavors from these European foods. It appears to be a hidden gem for those in the know because there are no signs out front of the restaurant. Nevertheless, the food here is absolutely incredible and because the cuisine is made with local fresh products, it changes on a seasonal basis. One of my favorite dishes that I personally had was the agnolo, which consists of crispy lamb rib chops served with farm roasted figs and a potato puree. Not to mention the pasta here is all homemade and some of the best pasta I've ever had. The Ribbo Social Club is a fine dining establishment that is situated on Anchorage 1770, a distinguished boutique inn on Bay Street. The short menu features inventive takes on meats, seafoods, and fresh vegetables, which is served on a large front porch of a pre-revolutionary style mansion. All in all, everything from the view, to the food, to the setting, to the wait staff is nothing short of exquisite. Now it is time to hear from you, the viewer. Drop a line in the comments section below with your favorite restaurant in Beaufort, South Carolina. Did we miss any? And be sure you give this video a like and subscribe to the Trip Companion if you haven't already. With that being said, thanks for watching and have a blessed day.